Hey, good morning. Welcome back to Poke Suit Channel and the Guitar Letter System. You're probably hearing a little fan in the background. I can't worry about that. I can't always have the ideal situation for doing videos. Hey, I'm showing, this is really an interesting guitar. I've got it like 50% off what I originally started the price at too. It's very collectible. It's, 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 there's only two or three of these in the world. It's the uh, Aria Elector Larry Correa model. Super arched flame back and top. Um, really really well made the, the headstock is just beautiful on this thing and it really has a sound it, i've read this from other people online and it reminds me a lot of like an l5 like an old gibson l5 with with a um an oval hull it's it's just very and the pickup sounds amazing but the more i play this guitar unplugged it's starting to even come into its voice so today i just want to talk about some simple chord connections because the more that you connect chords boy Let's let that go by. Chord connection. The more you connect chords, you're going to build your improvisational skills, and compositional skills are based on improvisational skills. So here's a great chord, which is the a nine chord, dominant nine chord, voicing root flat seven, uh, nine, three. If you add the top note, you get a 13. And that resolves nice to a, a major 13 flat 5, which is one of my favorite chords. So when you find something that works, do it Do it in different places, you know, like move it around so that your subconscious mind gets that kind of a harmony uh, inside your head, you know. So you like do it here. What's really good to do too is make subtle changes like you know like say you're doing this and then you know go to a major seven minor seven flat five non root thirteen 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 flat nine The more you improvise, the more you're going to build your ear, and you want to learn to be less predictable because, I mean, I'm not putting down diatonic harmony, but my guitar ladder system teaches 10 different systems of improvisation in a very organic way using the science of neuroplasticity, seeding the subconscious mind with ideas so, that, so it can connect. But um, if, you, if you base most of your improvisation on diatonic harmony, your, your writing and your playing is going to be boring and be uninnovative. Un so it's really important that you get to know the 10 different systems of improvisation, you know, intervallic, symmetry, secondary dominant, flat five subs, chromatic, common tone, chordal harmony, etc. So the way to begin to do, I mean, if you really, really want to take a quantum leap on the guitar, don't overthink it. Just go to go to stevezookguitars.com, scroll down the homepage, invest in 199. It's 100 studies. And... Uh, there's no note reading necessary, no, no, you know, it's very simple. There's not a bunch of complex theory. You, you, it's kind of an old school approach. I studied with Joe Pass a little bit when I was 21. I'm 71 now. I studied with Horace Hatchett. I've studied with some pretty, I'm probably 80% self-taught, but chordal improvisation really is the key to, to uh, discovering your own talent and actually augmenting talent. And discovering talent you probably don't even know you have. But anyway, it's the chord connection really opens up your musical ear and builds your own musical consciousness and it builds your subconscious mind understanding of music and tension and resolution. So nine chord to 13 flat five. Now here, I went to a major seven. Now I'm not gonna analyze that and come up with five different ways to explain it. It just gets in the way. Uh, great musicians say that, you know, analyzing, thinking, fragmented, always putting something in a cute little category is the enemy of flow state. Music is creating a flow state and you want to to improvise and build your musical consciousness. But yeah, you get a hundred studies in the guitar ladder system. I don't send them all at once. I send them a little bit at a time, but it really works. If you want a sample of my guitar ladder system, send me an email, stevezook7 at yahoo.com. That's seven, not spelled out. But you know, if, if you've looked around my channel, you can go to Vintage Guitar Magazine, vintageguitar.com, put in my name, read my CD review. 
I've got a couple products marketed by Dunlap. I've got a letter on my wall from Les Paul. I'm not trying to brag, but I know what I'm doing, folks. And if you if you invest the 199, you're going to make a quantum leap in your understanding of guitar. Anyway, so here nine chord major 13 flat flat five. There I add the ninth. Now I'm going to major seven. Now I'll think common tone. So the more that you improvise, the more you're going to grow your musical ear. And as long as I'm kind of just throwing out ideas here, I love this lick. Which is kind of a 13 flat 9 idea. Another uh, nice, I like the way it sounds together, is the harmonic minor to a 7 sharp 5 sharp 9. You always want to be improvising. You want to learn not to be so predictable. Improvisational skills are the fertile soil to compositional skills. So here I was doing the nine, dominant nine, little contra motion because I've got the bass going down and the treble going up. So a little contra motion. And then uh, do that in different places. Then I went to a major seven and then I used that common tone. 13 and then I went to a major 7 now we could cycle those uh, in perfect force anyway just little snippets here but yeah if you really want to take a quantum leap don't overthink it just go to stevesguitars.com invest in the guitar ladder system it's only $199 you are going to make a quantum leap there's no no advanced theory to give you a headache you just play the study. Cycle one is this one. But yeah, this guitar is pretty interesting. Kind of has a sound like an old Gibson L5. Some of the old Gibson arch tops did have little holes too anyway just want to share a couple thoughts so um, yeah if you have any interest I, I think I started this guitar at 5700 I'll take I'll take I'll take 26 plus shipping this is I know what I'm doing folks this is gonna be worth a, this is worth more money because they only made a couple of them I've seen videos of Larry Coriel playing this and uh, they only made two or three of these that the arch on the top not sure if you can see that but the arch on the top is just incredible Really, really, and it's got some bare cloth figure on the top. Really high, super high quality wood. This is made in Japan and uh, probably at the Mat Matsumoku factory by some of the best luthiers in the world. This is incredible guitar, very rare. Great investment as well as a great guitar. And the pickup just sounds amazing on it. All right, folks, take care. Let's all keep the positive faith. Oh, the world's a little crazy right now, but uh, the universe is unfolding in time, not unraveling. If you really want to take a quantum leap in your consciousness, metaphysical development, spiritual development, I teach a course called Time Align Transformation Lock. It's not dirt cheap. It's three grand, but it's worth every dime, and you'll have a, a total transformation of your life. If any interest, you can text me, 714-548-0385. My course is called Time Align Transformation Lock. And it helps you learn how to connect to the quantum field, connect to source, clear a pathway to spiritual growth, and become more supernatural. Ciao.